back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new my name is Alyssa, and i'm here with my sister so we're gonna be doing um we're gonna be making brownies yay um they're milk chocolate uh i think it comes with icing but we're not sure so probably not we don't got icing by the way so, <laughs> oh, so well. we're just gonna have to help okay, so we're gonna get all the ingredients um let's read the box um, the first thing it says we need water vegetable yeah, oil that. and two eggs okay we have vegetable oil right here and we have two eggs right here and, and we're gonna grab the we have water, water in the sink beside us yeah. and we have measuring stuff right here so we need three tablespoons of water okay first. i'll do that in a minute but one and a half cup of vegetable oil because this is half of more half of a cup of vegetable oil so i pour half of this oh it's not opening. And then, okay, we have half right here. I think we have to put the cake back batter in first. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna open it, and this is the brownie mix with like. This is our bowl. And then we're good. Why is it so hard to open? Wait. Okay. This is a getaway of opening it. Oh shoot! I got my fingers. Okay, then we're just gonna pour it in there like so. And we already washed our hands. Wanna crack before. the egg? Yeah, we washed our hands. So we're not disgusting, okay? You wanna? Give me a second to get in there. <laughs> That's what she said. That's what she said. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna toss that in the trash. Okay, and then this is what the yeah. batter looks like before we put any in the ingredients in it. We can both crack an egg. So now we're gonna put the two eggs in it. Just like that. Here, right, I'll show you. This is pretty messy. Okay, so there's my one egg. It's okay. No, where are the tablespoons? Um. And then that's the second egg. That was really hard to crack with one hand. But it's possible. Wait, what does that thing say? How much so, water do you need? We need three tablespoons. Of water? This yeah. is one whole tablespoon right here? Yeah, we need three of them. Three? Okay. Oh. There's one. Two. And there's three tablespoons of water. And then did you pour the vegetable oil in? Not yet. I was gonna do that. But. Oh, here. Okay, so we're gonna take the vegetable oil and we're just gonna pour it in there. This video is ratchet. <laughs> <laughs> and then we're, this is what it looks like before we stir it. It looks disgusting. Perfect. But it turns out good. Okay. okay, so now we're gonna take our mixer right here. This thing is loud. Yeah, it's gonna be loud, so beware. Right I'll put this on time lapse. So it's not so long. I really wanted to get it right. Trying to find some balance in my life. I never really put up a fight. So as you can tell, we just got done stirring it with this little spinner thingy. And we're gonna take the prongs out. And you want one? Here, I'll set it down for now. So that you don't get wet. Okay, here's one. How are we gonna fall in the sink? Okay, and then. This is what the cake batter is looking ah, like. Ah! It's falling Not the cake batter, but the brownie batter. Okay. Looking like and we straight doo-doo. A little pan right here. Wait, we need to preheat the oven. We're doing it okay. at Okay. So we put the oven on. 350. Um, yeah, 350. Um. <clears throat> okay. I wonder if it tells on. you what size this pan is. Well, mom always tells me it's around 350. I'm not Girl. talking about that. I'm talking about how long to leave it in there. Yeah, probably like an hour or 30 minutes. This one says 24 to 26 okay. minutes, and that one says 40 to 42. I guess we'll just do 30 minutes and see how that goes. So now we have to prep the pan. Should I put some aluminum foil? Is that? Yeah, probably. Okay, probably. we're going to grab some aluminum foils to put on top so it doesn't stick to oh, the okay. pan because we would get in serious trouble if it sticks to the pan. This is probably too much. 
Then what's wrong with it? <laughs> okay. Mm, you good? Yeah. Okay, and now we're just gonna spray on top of the aluminum foil. You wanna spray it? Let me spray it. Hold up. Okay, we're just gonna spray some cooking oil. Dang. <laughs> Only takes a little bit. And then I'll hold it while she pours it in here. Okay, then we're just gonna pour the liquid into the pan. That's a whole solid right there. <laughs> we need like a spoon to get it out with. I have a spoon right there. Okay, using the spoon. We're just gonna make sure that Look it's even thing. all around. Yeah, it may have not, it may have splashed on top of us. This so is what it looks like. Nice. Oh my god, the brownie stuff is coming out of the aluminum foil. This is ghetto. Ah, yeah, the ghetto! The ghetto. <laughs> you gotta do what you gotta do, okay? Okay, so I think that's good. Okay. And now, we're just gonna take our ghetto looking brownie mix and put it in the oven. And we're gonna wait for about 30 minutes for it to cook and We'll come back to you whenever the timer goes off. Okay, so we came in my room because oh. it's really loud in there. So this is what the brownies look like. They're kind of they look crusty. Ghetto. And then we took one out, and then this is what it looks like. Um, I'm gonna be doing. We're gonna be doing a taste test. Do you want to taste it? Sure. I don't really like brownies. Okay, so can you just take a piece? piece and then I'll take a piece. But listen, that's the piece. In my mouth. That's not really disgusting. Oh, this is disgusting. It just tastes like a brownie. She's just dramatic. No, it's. <laughs> it tastes. Oh. It's just. It's just yeah, So. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, it tastes good. So. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel. Um, <laughs> if you have any more videos for us to do in the future, just comment down below. And um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. I really wanted to get it right. Trying to find some balance in my